will dental calculus show in the rads? Will it will it affect trying to remove the tooth, the angle of the elevators, and all that? Um, yes, let me, let me qualify that. Great question. Uh, the calculus itself will not show on radiographs because of the angulation of the tube head and where those those are on the patient, unless they are. It is excessive, I, and by excessive, I mean onto the palate a centimeter or so, or maybe a half, even a half a centimeter, because the angulation being on the palate side, it will interfere. I've only seen that happen once. And that was a brachycephalic dog that had severe calculus on the palate side, uh, and again, a half to one centimeter. And then that will cause superimposition over the roots. You can see it on the crown, but it doesn't matter. <clears throat> That's not what you're, you're interpreting. You're interpreting the bone around the tooth root. So that doesn't play a role. So that being said, you don't, uh, don't have to remove it unless it interferes with the removal of the uh, either the bone over the root that is left that you need to remove to extract that tooth, or if it interferes with, with your instrumentation to remove the tooth, which generally doesn't happen, but if it does, you can quickly just take your, your extraction forceps and, and uh, take that off with those. So uh, not, really a, not really an issue at all.